doing? My name is Trenton Sanders, and you're tuning into the famous Living Room Network. Divine powers are always working for us because we're doing right. So listen, in this video, I'm about to tell you how to manifest anything you want. Is there anything that you want, anything you desire, anything you've been wishing for, hoping for, dreaming for? Listen, it's easy. You're going to get it. You're going to get it. I just want to let you know that right now because be careful what you wish for because you will get it, okay? You will get it. So I'm gonna tell you how to manifest anything you want, but I'm gonna tell you through my own personal law of attraction stories, okay? Once upon a time, I didn't know that my thoughts and my words were creating my reality. I had, I had no clue. And so I was always like living life in circles, like a rat running around those little, that little thing, you know, that little thing that turns, like I was dead, I was dead. And I was just like, yo, why do I keep running into the same type of problems, the same type of experiences? Why do I keep having the same problems with the same, in the same relationship? Why can't I get a different type of girl? You know what I'm saying? Like, I was just wondering like, how can I get out of this like rat race? Like, how can I get unstuck from like, not doing what I really truly want to do in life? And the only thing I wanted to do was have fun. You know, I wanted to do everything that I, that I desired to do. I wanted to be able to go out, you know, and spend, and circulate money. I say, see, I used to say spin. I used to say spend money. But see, now I learned, you know, how this law of attraction stuff work. Now I say I'm circulating money. It's funny because when I was at the bar yesterday and I got me a martini, when I wrote 2465 on a receipt, I said, oh, I just circulated 2465. So now the law of attraction has taught me that whatever I put out, I get back if I call it back. And see, that's just one of the techniques that I learned you know, using the secret law of attraction. But um, the truth of the reality is the, the, way to, the way to really get what you want in this world is you got to keep your energy in a positive vibration as long as possible. That's the competition that we're living in right now. The competition is whom shall ever can keep his or her vibration in the highest positive energy for the longest amount of time wins everything. So you got to ask yourself, how quick can you get mad? Okay. If somebody make you mad after this video, if somebody in traffic make you mad because they driving too slow, oh my God, if a red light come on, you're trying to get to work on time. If it, if it come on, you know what I'm saying? Like if you get mad really easy, if things are frustrating you, then guess what? That's setting you back like five yards. A sack football. Okay. So like. The person that is who is able to keep their energy in a positive vibration the longest and stay there, happy, energetic, ready to go, happy, ready to go, moving, 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 click, 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 boom, 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 all this energy coming at you. That's the person right there who's going to attract everything to them and they're going to manifest anything they want, okay? But see, I didn't know that. I didn't know that once upon a time. And so, like I said, I used to let everything get to me, man. I used to let my mama get to me. <laughs> I used to let my, everything get to me, man, my, my, my job. You know, I used to let the fact that I didn't have money get to me. I used to let all these problems like dwell in my mind. And I used to sit there and just dwell on them all day, like lip poking out, down and sad, broke, busted, disgusted. Failing to realize the more I thought about what I didn't have was creating more of what I was gonna experience in the future was not having what I wanted. You see what I'm saying? So when you, Push all that out the window. Let's say we pushed all that out the window right now, right? We pushed all that out the window and we start thinking like we supposed to think, which is what I'm about to tell you right now. Like the way you manifest anything you want, only think about what you want. Only think about what you want. Now, the reality of the situation, this is life. So you're gonna have positive days, you're gonna have negative days. You know, you're gonna have you're gonna have people that that try to come into your life and infiltrate your system. They're gonna try to make you get upset. Fellas, you're going to have girls that come in your life and turn you down. They're going to brush you off their shoulders and stuff like that. But you got to be the type of guy to be like, okay, I got turned down. <laughs> Let's move on. Let's move on. Let's keep each other. Let's keep... Because the more you sit and talk about it and dwell on it with your friend, like, man, you know, I don't know why she did that. All girls are, all girls are like bugaboos or whatever you want to call it. You know, they ain't trying to, you know, and, 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 and. you're going to create more of that experience the more you think about it. You see what I'm saying? Everything that comes into your reality, anything that you manifest is coming into your reality because you, you're constantly thinking about it. So that's all you got to do in order to get what you want. Constantly 
Think about it. If you want to live this dream life, you know you're going to be successful. You know that you're a celebrity, okay? You know that you're an icon of pop. That's how the icon of pop, all right? You know that you're iconic. Think about it all the time. Dwell on the fact that you're an iconic person, okay? Dwell on the fact that you're now a doctor, a surgeon. Dwell on the fact now that you're a dental assistant. Dwell on it before you even get there. Dwell on the fact that you play in the NFL. Dwell on it. Dream it. Believe it. See it in your mind's eye every day. Just meditate on what you want to have in your life. And I can guarantee you, your life will begin to align up in the same direction that your mind is focused on. See, your mind is like a GPS navigational system. Whatever you put in, whatever you are thinking about in your mind, that's where your life going to go. The mind, the brain, I'm getting a little bit... Uh, Metaphysical here, okay, so bear with me. So the brain, the mind, and the world that we live in are connected, okay? So just imagine if you ever thought in your mind about all the things that you wanted, what's going to happen out here? It's going gonna, it's gonna to line up. It's going to begin to line up, okay? And so, like I said, at the end of the day, the whole catch to manifest anything you want in your life is keeping your vibration at an extremely high level and not letting bullshit bring you down to its level because that's what bullshit demands that's what negative negative energy is basically like somebody coming into your life like i see what you're thinking i don't want you to be thinking that you should be thinking about me instead that's what negative energy say it's just like it's just walking up to you it's like oh you ugly you should you should listen to me because you are really ugly and you, you, you're having a decision to make, like, am I really ugly? Like, if you, if you guess, like, am I really ugly or not? I don't know I'm not ugly because I just looked in the mirror this morning and I did my hair. You know what I mean? If you, if you know that you're not ugly, then you're not going to give that person the time of the day. You're not even going to dwell on it. You understand what I'm saying? So that's when my life began to change. My life began to change when I stopped giving, like, negative energy attention because that's where my energy was going. And I started to think about only the things that I wanted for myself. Okay. And when I started thinking about what I want for myself, that's when everything began to just flow. Everything began to just come. And now I'm able to talk to other people and be like, well, I know why the reason you're not living the life you want because you're probably thinking about the negative things that are going on. Okay. And it's funny because I'm not doing anything different than anybody else, but I'm just changing my way of thinking. I'm just changing what I think about on a regular basis. Am I thinking about things that are going wrong in my life? No, because it's never going to go away. You're going to always have things that go wrong in your life every single day. But the question is, whomever is the person that can think about what him or her wants and go in the direction where they dream of is the person that wins and manifests anything that they want. Okay, so that's the question I want to ask you. Are you manifesting what you want? Are you manifesting what you want? Comment below right now. Leave a comment below right now. And just say, I am manifesting what I want. And then set it in stone by putting your name beside it. Put some emojis beside it. Put some little emojis beside it. You know, I personally like the little smiley emojis just like this. And I do like the um, little okay emoji too. So I'm going to put mine down there after the video. But anyway, comment below in the comment section. I am manifesting what I want and then put your name beside it. And if this video resonated with you, give this video a thumbs up. Oh, and share it to a friend to add to your universal bank account because you never know. It might come back in the form of money. Absolutely. Make sure you subscribe to my channel by clicking my face icon up there. Click that face icon. That's me. Yep. <laughs> That's me. Click that face icon so you can subscribe to my channel. And make sure that you hit the bell notification so that you can be updated every time I upload new videos to your cell phone. With that being said, check out one of these other two videos right here. In the meantime, both of my wonderful videos. I personally like this one. I think I made this one like, I made this one like a year ago. 